Good morning, boys and girls. I hope you had a marvelous Monday. Welcome to Tuesday. I hope you had everything that you needed to do all of your work for Monday, and that if you didn't, you reached out to us. Um, I tell you every day that we're here for you, and I really, truly mean that. So let's begin our Tuesday in prayer. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. From Jesus Calling. Don't worry about your weaknesses. Don't worry about those things you can't do well. Instead, accept this truth. You, need, you often need my help. In fact, it's those weaknesses that perfectly connect you to my endless strength. When you don't seem to have what you think you need, you usually worry. That's how most humans react. But don't do it. Just stop worrying by admitting, I can't do it by myself, Jesus. And then thank me for that weakness. Yes, thank me. It will free you from trying to be what you can never be, your own Savior. Because you are weak and sinful, you need a Savior who is strong and perfect, who can meet all your needs. You need me. Whether you are being quiet and still, or active and on the go, you can be filled with my strength. Being still with me, spending time alone with me, makes our connection deeper and stronger. I work for those who wait for me, doing for you the things you cannot do yourself. But there are many things you can do. As you go through your day, doing what you can, depend on the strength I give you. This glorifies me and blesses you. The next time you feel you just can't do something, turn to me right away. I'll be right there to meet you with my strength and love. A reading from the first letter of Peter. Above everything, love one another earnestly, because love covers over many sins. Open your homes to each other without complaining. Each one, as a good manager of God's different gifts, must use for the good of others the special gift he has received from God. Those who preach must preach God's messages. Those who serve must serve with the strength that God gives them, so that in all things praise may be given to God through Jesus Christ, to whom belong the glory and the power forever and ever. The word of the Lord. And we pray together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. We don't really have any new special announcements, just that our popcorn and cookie dough fundraiser is due on Friday. Um, I believe tomorrow we have a birthday announcement, so that'll be exciting. I hope you guys have a great day, and like I'll tell you every single day, if you need us, we are here for you. Just let us know. See you soon.